Welcome to Explody FPS, your go-to place for gaming fixes, troubleshooting, and optimization guides. Hello everyone, it's Saira, and today let's dive into the issue of HyperX cloud headset microphones not working. Headsets provide one of the most popular ways to interact with online audiences or engage in voice recording activities. However, several users, including many gamers, have reported that the microphone does not work when plugged in. In some cases, the microphone is detected, while in others, it doesn't appear at all on the computer. This guide will explore the issue and provide solutions to fix a non-functional microphone on the HyperX Cloud headset. Method 1. Enable the microphone input in the sound settings and set it as the default recording device. Usually, the sound card microphone is set as the default, while the internal laptop microphone remains ready. In some cases, the external or sound card microphone might be disabled, preventing you from using your microphone. This can also happen if you are using the HyperX USB dongle since it is detected as a sound card. To enable your microphone, plug in your USB dongle if you are using one, press Windows plus R to open the run dialog, type msys.cpl and hit enter to open the sound settings window. Go to the recording tab, right click anywhere on the list and ensure that show disabled devices and show disconnected devices options are checked. If any microphone device is disabled, right click on it and select enable. Right click on your HyperX microphone device or your sound card microphone device and select set as default device to make it active whenever it is connected. You can also set it as the default communication device if you plan to use it for calls on your computer. Method two, flip the HyperX Cloud microphone switch to on. If you are using the HyperX Cloud USB sound card or dongle, there's a microphone switch on the side. Make sure it is flipped to the on position. Method three, change your splitter or use the USB dongle. The audio splitter might be incompatible with the headset, especially if you are not using the provided splitter. You may need another splitter, which should have three black bars or segments on the jack plug pin, the end that goes into the headset. If you suspect the splitter is causing the issue, you can bypass it by using the USB dongle. Also make sure the 3.5 mm jacks are fully inserted, ensuring that none of the barrel is visible. It may require some extra pressure. If your cable is broken, consider replacing it to resolve the issue. That's all for today's guide. I hope one of these methods helped you fix your HyperX Cloud microphone. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more troubleshooting guides. This is Saira signing off. See you in the next one.